All right, Buck Walter. Big match tonight. Um, I think it was like 10-1 last year. Uh, Harrison Hightower put it on you in Athens. Uh, not not this time, man. Uh, you snake farmed in this, Coach, <laughs> Coach Hill would say. But, yeah. you know, he did a great job in that scramble, marathon scramble. And I know that, you know, you went to high school with the Alden brothers, and you've done a lot of scrambling. And you've probably been on the wrong end of some of those scrambles. But Definitely. winning that scramble, how important was that, that marathon scramble in the first period? Yeah, that was really important to get out to that lead. Uh, last, last year, the first period, I was down by like eight points after the first period. So this year, I wanted to just keep it close and uh, keep me in the match. And then uh, getting that takedown was huge. I was up by two points and then I had to go down. He's really good on top. So uh, I just went neutral and then uh, just went from there. So In the third period, you know he's really good on top. Right. You know he's real, like he's coming. I mean, he right. turned you a bunch of times last year. Right, yeah. When did you feel the pressure release? How did you, you know, get that reversal? Yeah, well, I know he likes to go to the bar. I'm on the left side. And we've been watching film on him, practicing in the room. And I just want to stay compact. Last year, I got all spread out. And he would just turn me and take me over. So I wanted to stay compact. And then I just waited for him to kind of make a mistake and then just capitalized on it. So. Looking at this match, you know, I talked to Mac McGuire. You're both Pennsylvania guys. Right. Do you guys feel this rivalry as much as the Ohio guys do? Yeah, I think we do. I didn't as much maybe my freshman year, but now being here for this is my fourth year, I definitely feel it. And uh, coach for, for Coach Anderson, this is a big match, and uh, and he really it really uh, trickles down to us, and we really we really want to win this match definitely, especially losing there last year for the first time in a long time. So. You know, you got an argument. There's a legit argument for Tyler Buckwalter, uh, you know, St. Louis, Missouri, NCAA tournament. You know, this is huge for you, beating a top 20 guy, looking at a match like this. You know, what do, what do you feel about March, and can, can you be at the NCAA tournament? Can you be competitive in the MAC tournament, be a placer, be the champ? What do you got to do to get to, to St. Louis? Yeah, I think I just keep out the training. Uh, this is the best my body's felt in a long time, and I just have to keep working at it and keep believing in myself and believing that I belong with these guys, you know. And, uh, this is one of my first big wins against rank opponent. I was close a couple times last year, so now finally getting one. I just got to believe in myself, I think, and I can do uh, get to Missouri and then see what happens from there. So, Did you ride the momentum of Mac and Ian's wins? Oh, definitely, for sure. The momentum was on our side. Ian, that was a huge pin, first match back. The momentum was on our side. I just wanted to go out and keep it going, so uh, that was big. All right, man. You're one of the smartest guys in the country. I love, I love saying it over and over. Uh, you having more fun this year, would you say? Yeah, definitely. Definitely more fun this year. It's not fun wrestling through pain like last year, so it's definitely more fun this year. All right, you got anything else for me? No, thank you. Congratulations on the big win. Thank you. Thank you.